people at like the 99.5 percentile are in quants and 100 percentile is someone like you who attempts the quants i think there is a small difference in the way they attempt it the reason is my take would be i'll just first pick some 14 15 questions which are very doable in the less time and i finish them then i'll in the remaining time i'll try to do additional one or two questions but if someone is targeting like very high percentile like 100 let's say something like 55 or 50 plus score consistently so how would you manage those 40 minutes in 22 questions is it that some questions are there in which probably at first uh, sight we may not get the logic in the very first set but after spending one and a half minute or so we could get that deal with those kind of questions during the paper or at the end of the paper like at the last few minutes what is the first thing i want is okay when i look at a question okay i have to understand the question okay that is very important because reading a question and understanding it is also time consuming okay yes. i don't know whether you noticed it or not yes, okay yes. now i feel that if i read the question i understood it i already made progress in my opinion okay even if i solve it or not is different because when i come back to solve it next time that time will not be wasted right so the way i go about it is i want to solve a question in an ideal situation i solve all the 20 questions one by one okay without any issues sometimes i feel that uh, i get stuck in some question but if i get stuck in that question i console myself by telling that i have at least read the question okay i understood the question i made one way to solve it i got stuck somewhere or it became very lengthy but at least i made some progress okay then i try to tell myself is there can i rule out some options okay if i rule out an option or if i rule out two options i mark something i mark it for review and go to the next one okay because again that gives me less stress because i know that there is at least 50% chance i'm getting it correct if i don't have like if i don't get time to answer it back okay now suppose in for whatever reason i'm not able to make any progress okay that won't happen i always make some progress okay so but still i'm not able to rule out any option uh, i mark it for review i go to the next one but the typically what happens is once i finish all the 24 questions okay all the 22 questions i would uh, be left with around say 7 8 questions and i would have around uh, 10 to 11 minutes okay the next time i come there is then i have to like run okay till then it was okay but then i have to run basically is that in one minute i have to make a choice okay i have to make a choice and i focus mostly on either eliminating okay or trying to figure out what to do next okay those kind of uh, like hacks i try to use the second time i try to solve okay many times it works many times it doesn't work okay but this is basically my strategy but i always know that the second time i come i don't take that much time because like i told you i already read the question i understood the question and i also tried